Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Victoria 2, playing as Brazil. So, last time we did some more territorial expansion. We now are, though, in a war against Peru and the United States of America. Now, a couple comments. One was including saying that uh, I shouldn't call in the UK to all my wars, because I can probably handle it myself. And that's true about the South American miners. Absolutely true. I can probably beat up Argentina just by myself pretty easily, honestly, at this point. Uh, but it's always fun to call in Britain to smack people down, especially if you want to go to war with a South American nation, take some of their coal, and they call them the Americans. Well, the reason I called them in Britain for this one is because, well, let's have everyone beat up on the Americans, and the Peruvians, but mostly the Americans here. And they're also at war with another group, so I figured, you know what, why not? And we're going to need a little bit more money, it looks like, so sorry about those... That's pension plan, Grandpa, but we kind of have to do this right now. And we're doing it well against Peru. I mean, I've, we'll have no problems against Peru whatsoever. But, let's see, let's let time go on a little bit. Wow, we are losing a lot of money. That is a crud ton of money. Nice, more organizations, always good. Uh, you are 8th? ninth. Hmm. Well, they want to try to siege that back, that's okay. Yeah, we're losing quite a bit of money. That's not good. Uh, just a little bit of education. Education is very expensive. Actually, running a military isn't that expensive. Oh, sometimes. Uh, you know what? That might just work out really nicely for us. If that's the case, come down here too. Just in case, because these guys might have good defense in jungle territory. And you're moving to Cusco. Cool. Come to Cusco. Up, oh, and we get attacked. Alright. Oh, hello. The Great Wars have been discovered. Cool, from the UK, nice. Good, you know what, just in case, help them out down here, have a good time. Another comment saying, uh, safe scumming is for noobs. Well, I never said I was a professional Vicky 2 player. <laughs> I never said I'm a professional video game player. If I have to save scum to make us do things, then I probably will, you know. Just to get things, get the ball rolling and stuff. Let's see, subsidies? Uh, I don't know if I believe in subsidies. Pensions? Hmm, workday? Let's, let's improve the workday a little bit more. Nice, we won that battle. A glorious battle, to be sure, but good. Yeah, don't attack them when they're defending. Yeah, do that. That'll be fine. Keep doing what you're doing. Just go that way. Yeah, we're going to need to find other ways to make more money. Sorry, capitalists. Uh, Sorry, no social spending for now. Ah, look, the Brits are there. How wholesome. Really, we're just waiting for everyone to kill off America's navies. Oh, they're trying to attack Canada. Interesting. Yeah, education system isn't doing so great right now, but that's okay. Uh, we're in a mobile war, so. It is what it is. There go the Brits. They want that tile. They want that territory. We're going to come right there. We're going to come right there. And are these guys going to move? Maybe, maybe no. Oh, the Portuguese Navy's trying to help us out against them. Or just killing off the Peruvians in general. Oh, hello. Now, they're in the montane grass, and that'd be a terrible idea to attack. So we're not going to. Now, this is a bad idea, since they are probably in the montane grass hills. Yep. But with enough support, we'll do more than fine. I could let them run, but soon enough they're not going to have any sort of ability to do really of anything around here. Nice! Oh, we just killed them all off. Awesome! Now they have one more army here, which is fine, whatever. Oh, awesome! Lima! Lima time! And then we'll focus on that last army up there, too. Uh, let's see. Great Wars. Italy, how are you doing? You don't like the Americans? Hey, we got something in common. We both don't like America right now in this campaign, and that's okay. The Tens... Oh, what the heck? Tens and Concessions? I've never seen that. Of course, this is HFM, so... Is that it right there? No, that's Jacobin Rebels. That's Japan. Way high. German Empire, they got that. Oh, it's Port Arthur. Oh, it's something right here, too. Oh, here it is. Old Tianjin. Hmm. Oh, look. Now, this is beautiful right here. But I don't got money to expand them railroads. I wonder how much... The fifth in the world. I'd like to see how much, how many ships they have. 
Because obviously our ships will get blown up, but time is on our side, become our socialists, curtail local distribution. Oh, the Russians have shown up. What is this going on? Entered an alliance. Oh, well, that is interesting. That is quite interesting. All right, so you guys are good right there. Uh, come up there. Uh, actually, you guys might have enough strength to do it just because they, they don't have a lot of things right there. I might even just lower my budget during war right now just because I really have no interest in fighting America by itself. So, oh, here, hello, Britain. Oh, you're completely ignoring me. Okay, whatever. Cool. Oh, you sieged it down. That makes sense. Uh, and the Russians sieged that down. Ecuador entered into alliance with them. I'm at war now. What if I just want to go to war with these guys? I mean, Venezuela is going to have some pretty f good fuel soon enough. We're already at war with America. Relations. Screw it. You know what? We can probably afford this right now. Well, let's over to half. There you go. There you go. Now that's nice. Get that back up there. Maybe lower taxes a little bit too. Nice. Nice. Got a couple rebels here and there. That's okay. Yeah, actually. So we're going to get this province. And I'm still going to be disconnected from these guys. Colombia? I can't really afford a war with Chile. They're actually pretty strong, Chile is. But Venezuela, they're only allied with Haiti, Dominican Republic, and Ecuador. Is this for a war with America? Why not? Acquire State 11? Oh, that's pretty close. I have a good feeling, though. This war is going to take a, quite a while, so... You guys can leave the area. You guys can stay there. I'm going to send you guys back home. We have an army down there. Uh, put one up next to Venezuela then. And if we're making money, we doing well. Nice. Jamaica is our ally right now. Seems like this war might go on forever. But they're doing a pretty good amount of damage to Canada, which isn't ideal. I'm not going to end this war until, like, America gives in, so... I'm not the war leader, unfortunately. Wow, there's really no support for conservatives. So be it. I'm not even the yeah, I'm not even the war leader, so. Hungarian liberation of Vojvodina. Oh well, they're probably gonna lose. Okay. Eight hour workday, sure. Minimum minimum wage. Nice. Wow, look at that. There's there's definitely a little bit too much socialism for the voters' ideologies. I mean, I don't think Brazil was this socialist. I could be wrong in nineteen oh three, but I don't think that's correct. I could be wrong. I said, like, like I said, I could be wrong. I think it might be just a little bit too much. So, we'll see what happens. If they start invading the UK, we're going to have a serious problem, but... You got a little problem with Ireland right there, UK? Um, wow. But, you know what? With money, maybe we can build a better navy. Well, maybe not. Maybe I should actually spend time researching naval attacks. Yeah, keep, just keep that guy there for now. That'd be good. It's fine with me. Whatever. Kill off Ecuador. Maybe take some stuff from Venezuela. So. It's not like we were getting immigrants anyways. It doesn't really matter to us. Uh, a little more taxes, maybe? Maybe not. Maybe spend a little bit less. No, we're doing pretty well. Military directionism is good to get. Good, because we're going to get gas attack, hopefully. Aeronautic sounds like fun. We can wait maybe just a little bit. Let's get some steel steamers. Maybe get some cruisers. Cruisers are very nice. They haven't invaded me yet, which is good. The May Day Parade. Com commemorating bomb throwers and murderers in one of my states? Uh, let's see. Naturally, we support the final play of international solidarity between workers. Until next year, we get less pop militancy. That actually might be worthwhile. New evidence worsens scandal. Things do not bode well. Oh, boy. Brazilian conquest. I mean, we're still doing well. I mean, you can try to siege down Canada all you want, but that's not going to happen. Grave consequences. A bad way to start elections. Oh, great. Yeah, it looks like Hungary's doing pretty well. It's in Brazilian Patagonian international. Yeah, suppress it. Ooh, that's not looking good. 
But yeah, that's really not looking good. Italy, Austria. There's really no point to do that. Then the German sphere. Nice. Uh, how about increase relations with the Danes? Ah, oh, they're 10th in the world. They're right behind us. Nice. Alright, so now we're losing a little bit more money whatsoever. Oh, the UK is trying to blockade America. Oh, but look at that. That's disgusting. Crackdown on these radicals. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, America is really trying to destroy Canada. Makes sense, though. I mean, you can try to siege them out, but I don't think we'll ever give in. Even, yeah. It, Italy and Germany have taken over Alaska. Nice. Wealth. <sighs> Good pensions, more population growth? Eh, I guess. Whatever. Doesn't mean I have to spend money on this. Can't afford it. A little bit less supplies. A little bit less military here. Ah, oh, we got gas attack! We've got gas attack. Awesome. Hanging out, having a good time. Why don't you go to the Venezuela? Oh, wait. Oh, can we go? Oh, we didn't go to war just because we... Well, yeah, it's a little too high right now. I don't want to risk it. Really don't want to risk it. So, I mean, you can take out Canada as much as you like. No one's going to give up that, though. Especially... Oh, who's this? The Netherlands. Ooh... Uh, I'm going to say yeah for now, but we'll see what happens. I really want to ally Germany, though. Maybe that was not a good idea. American War of Cuban Freedom? Yeah, no. So this war is going to last probably forever. So be it. Give them full citizenship. Awesome. Oh, wait. You guys are reactionary. Truly tis. Cool. Russian Empire. Hope you're having a good day. Ottoman Empire. Uh, probably don't need to do too much with you, but that's okay. Military access? I'll give you that. Germany, you want some military access? Yeah. If that could help me, like, finish this war faster, I would totally be okay with that. Now, for Japan, Conservative Party won 42% of the vote. Wow. Alright, so we're at peace with these guys, but now we're still at war with America. Well, looks like... Oh, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got, we got the coal. We have got the coal, my friends. We are coal buddies. Nice. Now we can put you up here. Just in case. And America might white peace out with us. Propose peace. Yeah. F fighting for ourselves. This might ruin relations between me and the UK. Oh, they're the Populist Party. Interesting. You know what? That's okay. Let's go ahead and do that. Ah, peace. But not for much longer. We, let's cut down our infamy just a little bit, and then we'll get take this off of Venezuela. And even though someone doesn't want me to call them UK here, they're a little busy. Oh, I mean, we might not. Hmm, we'll see what happens. If they can't come down here, they're, if they're still blockaded, I probably won't need to call them in, so. Ah, the demand reparations. UK demands this from the United States. Well, I've certainly set up an interesting scenario. Steam turbines, good. Dreadnoughts. Brazil needs a navy. And just in case, let's go into increase relations just in case. Good, good, good. Increase the relations with the UK because we pieced out separately. Oh no, we're still good. We're still allies. Awesome. Austria lazy is a core culture. Awesome. Brazilian conquest. Well, it's not going well for Canada. Oh, but they got a little piece of territory here. And where's the American navy? They have two ships there. They must have all died or something. All died in a marching ban accident. Well, they don't have it fully sieged down, but a lot of it's blockaded. There we go, with the pensions again. Ah, uh, but you know what? Since we're here, and we have a little bit of money. They have a steel mill. Ah, good. Good. So we have a steel mill. Machine parts, then. And... Oh, no, 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 no. You're going to open up. You're going to get subsidized. We're going to max you out right there. I believe we have a steel mill machine parts. We're not a lot of money. Electric gear factory. Yeah. Because we're not at war. We do that too. Lower that by quite a bit. Oh, let the money flow in. Drop it by another hundred. We'll be okay. Let 
Capitalists invest in us. Nah, it's so cutting down that meat. Uh, America? Nope. Do you enjoy the ranches? Sure. Also, we want to improve, improve infrastructure here as well. Uh, you guys are primitives. I could still take these guys out. Ten infamy. Um, you guys. I'm okay. I don't want to piss anyone off by doing that, so. Sorry. Nice. Forts, those are really expensive. Improve the industrial score. If we can continue improving our industrial score, then we'll easily, then we will pretty easily be able to get great power status. Mexico, you want an alliance? Uh, sure, I guess. Sure. Cutting that number down still. Good. A little bit of money. Could use a little bit more, but with all these, oh yeah. That looks pretty important. Nihilism and the will. Alright. Yeah. Invest in railroads. Definitely invest in railroads. I doubt we're getting too much here. Oh, yeah. Peru and Colombia. Someone also said in the comments yesterday, become a constitutional monarchy. Well, that's a little impossible for me right now. Maybe in time. But right now, it's kind of impossible. Excelente. Game of Italy, Netherlands. That's cool. Acceptable pensions. Sure. Oh, we actually are losing people to Brazil. Hmm. No, Brazil. I mean, Mexico. I am Brazil. Good. Cut it down a little bit more. Eh, increase relations, probably. Military scores going down for the Americans. That's nice. That's very good. Ah, good. But I will continue to increase it. It's probably being a little bit of a drain on the UK as well. Oh, no, they're... Their military score is really good. Wow. Just a lot of wow. 39 ships is the only fleet we got. We got plenty of screens and two dreadnoughts. Two beautiful dreadnoughts, my friends. Beautiful. Anywhere else we need to invest in thingamabobs. Probably not. Nice. Very awesome. Ooh. Shift work. Electrical power generation. This stuff is all really good. I'm going to go with this one first, though. Shift work. Ah! Dreadnoughts! There we go. That's really great. That's really, really great. Hey, we're actually losing a little bit of money here. Oh, no. Temperance and labor. Sure, whatever. What are national focuses? What do we set I should here? Craftsmen there. That's, oh, cruisers, awesome. Can't really afford to build too much more right now. <gasps> We're eighth. We can become a great power soon. Oh my goodness, that'd be so good. Oh, this war's still going on. Oh, you're level. What? Oh, what happened there? Oh, do we not get an event? Do they just wipe peace out or something? Nice. Farming efficiency. Awesome. Little colony there. Little colony there. Oh, they can use railroads. Alright, anything else around here? No. Yeah, really trying to help the bureaucrats out. And, of course, you guys. Cholera. Quarantine the province. Cholera. There's a lot of craftsmen here. You could probably get rid of that for now. And look at this. You go need bureaucrats. Good pensions. Helps with the population growth, so that's good. Nice. Continue increasing relations with these guys. They are a republic, of course. Populist party. Huh. Truce? Oh, Alaska. Oh! 
Hello. Whoa. Do it. What is that little blue silver? Alaskan. Alaskan has its own culture. I can't believe we made it. We're super close. Now, who's a great power? So we gotta wait until the Kingdom of Italy falls out of eighth place, because now we got a little bit more score than them. Nice. No better factory costs. More industry, please. More industry. Look at that money. Yes. Invest. See what you can do about it, guys. Even though it's probably not the best way to do it, but whatever. Now we're out of money. <laughs> well, just like that. Address for Parliament. Excellent. Lose some consciousness. And let's go ahead and... Oh. The Brazilian Red Star... Ooh, poor Shroud at Rich... Uh, I really don't like... I don't really need him right now. We're already pretty content with the Conservative Party. Wow. 49, 45? 1980? Oh, boy. I'm not a great power. I am not a great power. I, I can't support either side. Oh. Cecilia acquires all states... What the heck? Is that Cecilia? No, that's... Where's Cecilia? Uh, no, that's... What the heck? Cecilia? Russia. I've... N Sicilian? Is this like like the ancient like culture like from Rome Total War? Like there's like Sicilian pirates or something in that game? Is that... What? What? Greek? Bulgarian? Armenian? These guys are never gonna get it. Never gonna get it. Mm -mm. We're gonna have mass revolutions in the country before we get that. Trinket sub oh, trinket subsidies. Uh, well, I don't have to. I don't have to actually do that. So, all right. I can make him my puppet, but this is much more fun. Justifying actually on them. Taking that, and then next, and we'll probably we might go for Paraguay. Political lobbying, cool. Or maybe actually Argentina. Yeah, I definitely want to take more of Argentina to take this little province here. But you never know. I don't exactly know where the oil fields are in Venezuela, obviously. Maybe... I mean, there's a lot of fruit. There's a lot... There's some coffee, some fish. Uh, just improve the economy. No, we've dropped down. No, 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 no. We're so close. That's like my main goal in this campaign. Make Brazil a great power. A global power. Oh, that's going to help out so much. Electrical power generation. Oh, yeah, that's through put. And then electric arc furnace. New store and something. Demma? Cool. Maybe a little bit of social spending, not too much cash crops. Yeah. That's going to hurt our budget. I really don't like using that, but it makes people have higher standards of living, I believe, so... Conservative, yeah, whatever. Oh, the UK is under their alliance with France. They're now part of the French liberation of Elsa Lothringen against the Germans and the Ottomans. Aren't you still in the war against America? Yeah, you are. That's really oh, that's not good. So now, oh, that's gonna be is that gonna be a great war? The second wait, the second Italian liberation of Austrian Istrian. Whoo, man, you're the world's on fire right now. That means it's a good time to sell guns and goods. Belgium and Dora, Russian Empire, France, and the UK versus Poland, the Spanish Republic, Denmark, Liechtenstein, the powerhouse of Liechtenstein, the Ottoman Empire, and Germany. Holy cow. Oh my goodness. Um, Andorra, aren't you that country right here? Yeah. Um, I don't know why you need access through here. Oh, good. That went down. Good, 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 good. If I say yes, does that mean they can't go to war with me later on? I'm going to say yes. Because I, I, mm, I don't know. If I keep increasing relations, they might not go to war with us. And also, those, oh, Earth, San Francisco earthquake. Cool. Uh, that was another comment from yesterday. They probably intervened into my affairs going to, into war with Vietnam because they have high enough relations. That's probably it. And we're done to choosing a trade policy, probably. Never bothered me with this again. 
Yeah, there's still not anything else we can do. We need to spend a lot of money. Just a ton of money. I should save up a lot more money. Two million, I think, pounds. We need Mass Baltics or 1908, so... Good. Let the world explode, please. Argentina's looking at uh, lockout. Hey, that's unconstitutional. Become a reactionary. Oh, Andorra, white peace. That makes sense. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I... I oh. Can Germany and HFM fight a two-front war? That is what we are going to discover today, my friends. Can they fight a two-front war? What is it on the budget docket? Well, a little bit less. Social spending. Wealth? Nope, you're never going to get that. Oh, Belgium is just dying. Holy cow. Oh, they must have pieced out. Oh, there go. Oh, they finally have a white piece. That must have drained... Oh, hold on. You're still fighting. No, you're mobilized. You're still mobilized. Okay. Yeah, that killed off Canada a lot. The UK has still got a lot of gum gumption. Oh, they... Why'd they white piece out? What? I want... I want destruction. I want South American greatness. Why? Kill each other off. Make me great again. Or make me great. What the heck? I, I refuse to go to war... Oh. Oh. Monaco. War to end all wars. Um, okay, so I refuse to go to war with any other enemy. Actually, would you not like alliance? No. Oh, if we keep increasing relations, we might be able to. Right now, we're 80% of the way there towards that. Wealth vote. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm so glad we got this, though. Oh, look at that. Afro-Latino, that's cool. Brazilian, yep. Yep. Stockpile that money. We're going to need to stockpile that stuff. For sure. Alright. You know, we can stockpile it or we can just expand more factories. Nice. Oh. Secession of Zuliar Bolivar. I definitely want Bolivar. But let's give some time. Let's lower our... We're going to go to war by May. But lower our infamy limit too. Or limit... Infamy. Just infamy. Oh, come on. I really want to see them smack each other. I want it... Actually, that looks like a pretty good Hungary. Honestly, that's not too bad. So how's the war between them going? Oh, no. The war ended. The third Ottoman liberation of Bulgarian Thrace. Kuwait. Hungary. The Russian Empire in Bulgaria. Oh. Oh, boy. Ottomans. I would not have picked a fight with them. Awesome. More Santa Anna. The and Monaco has founded fascism. Black shirts of the revolution. Men and women of all Monaco. Men and women all over the world. Listen, the government has grown weak. Oh, low, I'd rather have low subsidies. It just... It's just better overall. I I need to keep this party in power because it's so good. Socialist Brazil. I mean, it's not bad, but we already have what we want. What? I see integralists. I think. Hmm. I think. Hmm. Nice. I could increase my military power too. All right. Let's go and do this first, though. Oh, we can't. I need to make this bigger, bigger, bigger. Rock me in my cradle. Yeah, we're going to make. We're going to need some bigger naval bases. Yeah, I do not want to go to war with a great power if without a great power ally. So, increase relations again. Nice. Hmm. Automobile. That'd be good. Ah, oh, good. Research is done. Shouldn't take too long to get that. Then maybe we'll get some more army techs, maybe. It's 1907 now. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We were so close, though. Oh, Spanish Morocco is... Well, Morocco's gone now. But we were so close to having a great war. I really want to see what's going to happen. Ottoman Restoration? Oh, they're... Oh, they're trying to make, take back Sicilia. Romania, oh, you guys are not doing well right now. Go, Italy, go. Kill each other off. N extended subsidies, fine. I'm not going to give you that much anyway, so. You can have 9% subsidies. 9% social spending. I love... We tax the lower class, I give you so much money. Ah. Berber, Maghrebi... Uh, I doubt there's anywhere else that we can really build roads, or we really need to right now. We're doing pretty darn well. Awesome, let's grab the next one. Yeah. 
That'll be good. Let's go and do this as well. Oh, and we need to go to war by May. My soldiers aren't really ready. That was my fault. I'm glad I caught that. I will still call my allies in, because I'm a little bit of a noob still. That's okay. And America still joined. Mexico didn't... Mexico? You could have had it. You could do it really well, man. You chose not to, though. Why? So now we're at war with Dominican Republic, Haiti, Venezuela, Ecuador. Interesting. I'm going to put you guys right there. And back at war. It's like, it's like my national pastime. Just war. I love it. And that doesn't even matter anyways. Good. I got a couple armies down here. Oh, that's not good. They might conquer all this area, which wouldn't be very good. But, you know what? If we can cut them down, maybe they don't have a lot of army techs. That'd be very nice. Venezuela started to mobilize. Cool, we have war happen to us. Oh, boy. Oh, look at them. They're fighting. Uh, you'll be fine. Don't even go there. Just go straight for the capital. <gasps> We're a great power! We've done it! We've done it, my friends! What is this stuff? The Quan Chao Wan Concession, meaning Guangzhou Bay, is situated in Guangdong Province, on the east side of the Laizhou Peninsula, north of Hainan. Right now, the cities are commercially unimportant, but are strategically located. We will need it in order to counter the growing British commercial power in Hong Kong. I... What?! I get a Chinese treaty port? Increase conscription time. Um, sure. Whoa, we could nationalize our industry. Perform nationalization. This might piss people off. No more will the foreign dogs grow fat off of the sweat of our people. The time is coming to seize assets owned by outsiders to be cared for by the state. I'm gonna not do that yet. Let's, let's leave it be for now. Oh my goodness. We. Whew. Now that is awesome. I wasn't. I didn't even know we could get that. Come to Brazil, owner of a Chinese province. But let's see. Let's do a little bit more before we call it an episode, my friends. Go and smash those Venezuelans and Ecuadorans. Take their capital from them. They don't need that where we're going. Take Pura. Probably we can smash him. Oh, maybe not. Maybe. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. Now, das, nice. Where are they headed to? Pure. I, hope our, I hope we can win there. Hope we can. Very good. Oh, we just took the capital. Wait. Who's in this? Wait, why is the France in this war? Um, France, are you feeling okay, America? Okay. That is... Not gonna lie, a little nuts. Alright, so we're fighting... Oh, yeah, we are smashing the crud out of these guys. Oh, I wish this was a great war. I wish this was a great war. Oh, yeah, Russia. Yep, yeah, yeah, buddy. Mmm. Mmm, this is tasty. Mmm. Can't edit any, any more. It's not well. It's not the war's not going well enough for us. Nice. Actually, wait. Demand. Oh wait, we got it. We just got it. Awesome. Awesome. I was wondering wh where where is the stuff? No draft. Uh, nah. No, no, no. But anyways, we're gonna leave that here for now. We have reached more of the Atlantic coast. Venezuela looks disgusting, but. Maybe next time we'll go to war with Argentina as well. Hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we continue to munch more on South America. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.